we're gonna clean out every single blacksmith in Skyrim and then we get to do it again when we go back to the place. <laughs> your children, your very one day, one day, I'm going to very stealthily put an arrow through you, Heimskir. What race is my character? My character is a red god. I saw them in the character creation and I went, yep, that's my people right there. Gods be praised. I am a melee person, let's go. Okay. Uh, this one. This one. Oh god, and now we're already at the point where... Uh, do we have something that's 120, 108, It was going to be either the Red Gods or the Orcs, because those are the two big melee race uh, characters. And I'm very, very much a melee person. Um, let's sell some potions while we're here, because I'm pretty sure I still have a bunch of stuff with negative effects. What do you need, my friend? So you're interested in my potions and ingredients? I don't need that. Uh... Oh, yeah, no, then we don't sell that to her. Um, this, we can sell you one of this. Let's go. Come back anytime if you need a remedy. Yeah, CQC. I started off with a two handed and then I decided to, uh, to branch out and do one handed and, uh, shield so i could get some more skill points but as soon as i've maxed out one-handed and block we're going back to um we're going back to two-handed okay i don't have any scrolls to sell him that's weird okay well then you get the invisibility thing this you get Yeah, these. I need to get these out of my inventory. Do come back. I also do a lot of alchemy and enchanting for this build, honestly. And I have an entire list of things that I still want to learn. So. I bet you could slay one of those mean old dragons. I bet you could do anything. Yep, I can actually. I don't know what you did, but Brave won't even look at me now. When reverting back to two-handed, you would you use the uh, would you use the uh, ebony blade? I don't actually remember what my best two-handed weapon is. Welcome. We've got small weapons. I think Welcome it's a warhammer. It's the one with the highest damage that I have right now. I haven't actually gotten into smithing weapons for myself yet. So. Yeah, let's sell you this. And this. Oh god, why is this axe worth so much? And I made myself a paralyzed pickaxe just in case I need to get out of dodge because I do carry a pickaxe with me at any point anyway. So I figured I might as well put a paralyzed pickaxe. Okay, 328, let's go. Good doing business with you. All right, now we get to go to all the other cities to try and sell our shit. <laughs> Riverwood, let's go. We could actually advance the main story while we're here. I just don't want to. I want to sell my stuff and then go back to the uh, Thalmor. What? Take a look. <sighs> Weapons. Um... 
Oh god, why do you only have so little money? The finest weapons and armor. Oh god. Do we have something? Oh, yeah. You can have an elven helmet. Good day. There you go. Um Does Iverstead have a smith? I don't think so. Riften definitely has two places where I can sell armor. Maybe even three. Now I remember. You're that new. Uh, let's wait until 10 a.m. All right. Take a look. First of all, let's get more of these potions out of our inventory. Where were they? These. Don't really need resist poison. I really appreciate what you've done for me. I'll never you gonna buy some? Everything I've got on display, really. All right. Um. Two hundred thirty-two. Two hundred and thirty-two. There you go. Take a look. Oh, no, that's not what I wanted. I actually wanted you to tell me about the thief guild. They'd stop at nothing to take your last bit of food if that's all you had. The ratway's too good a place for that scum. Come back when you're ready to spend more gold. Goodness knows I could use it. Divine smile on you. You've been a good friend to me. Take a look. Okay, more selling. Let's go. Uh, I think we still have some glass axes that we need to sell, right? Okay, that's the last one. Um... Oh, wait, did I just... Oops! The finest weapons and armor. Did I just sell him the armor that I'm actually wearing? Get that. <laughs> I sold it to him for 500 and he gave it back for 2000 something. Wow. Well, at least he has gold now, so he can buy more shit from me. You can have this one. <laughs> yeah. Oops. Oh wait, these I can actually sell them, just not this one. Got it. That was my bad. Let's put our clothes back on before we get arrested for indecent exposure or something like that. Uh, where is my armor? Glass armor, exquisite. Nobody saw that. La 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 la. <laughs> Uh, Pawn brawn, let's go. Let's buy some up or let's sell some more potions. Welcome. Some may call this junk. Me, I call them treasures. Potions. And I just realized we could have gone to the miscellaneous trader in uh, Riverwood as well. Yes.
Oh, we've got some more poisons that we need to sell. Okay, that's gonna be the next one. <sighs> Alright, I think we're done selling stuff in Rift. Oh no, wait, we have an alchemist down here. My that husband we... Bercy will be the death of me. He spends too much time worrying about Rift and not enough about himself. Yeah, let's sell our remaining potions. Let's go. I'm kind of busy. You here for lessons? So, you're interested in my potions and ingredients? Potions, let's go. All the way to the bottom. Can I have this, 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 this as well. Uh, actually, you can have my cure disease once because I'm a werewolf. I don't get diseases. So, thank you and goodbye. Alright. Next. Uh, let's actually go to Markov because we have a bunch of stuff to hand in at Markov. And I know they've got two smiths there, so... Should be good. All right. I saw you with the Forsworn. Oh, God, that was something. Yeah, in case you didn't notice, I also killed them all. So, you know. But not going back into that mine. Hang on, that's the smelter. Where is the actual smithy? Oh, there it is. Hi. Need a new blade? Looking to protect yourself? Or deal some damage? You can have these. Wait, are these guys still lying around here? I killed you like a month ago. Why are your bodies still here? Who's responsible for cleaning up this city? I want to have words. You have dead bodies in the street for like months and months. Oh, that's the Dwemer Museum. We don't need that. It was very good for uh, up, uh, for leveling up our lockpicking skill for. Alright. In here? Yeah. I'm the Jarl. Blades, helmets. Pretty much anything to suit your needs. Let's go. You can get my glass helmet. What? Why do I only have so little gold left? What's going on here? <sighs> okay. Alright. Uh, Eggmund. Outsiders aren't trusted in Markarth. Let's keep that in mind. Madanak has been found to be the true murderer of Markarth. On behalf of the city, I apologize for your wrongful imprisonment. The leader of Deepwood Raider up this dead. I'm impressed. Forsworn usually makes short work of mercenaries. But you took care of him. Here is your reward. Do you have any more work for me? I do. A personal matter. My father died trying to negotiate with the Forsworn. Back when that was possible. They took his shield to those Hargraven beasts they consort with. I need you to bring it home where it belongs. I warn you, it's dangerous work. No man of mine has ever faced a Hargraven and lived. <laughs> I'll understand if you decline. 
Do you have any idea how many hack ravens I killed, my man? I've lost count. Uh, don't worry about me, I'll do it. Watch over you. Awesome. Retrieve that shield at all costs. I'm Igman's uncle. Uh, the Jarl has put out a bounty on some bandits. Here, take a look at this decree for details. Oh wait, he, this is a radiant quest. Oh. You're someone who can get things done. I like that. Do you have points in speech to increase their, yeah, their income? I think I have a few points in speech. Not sure if they are for the income increase. Let me have a look. So yeah, I have two uh, points in haggling. Um, my current priority list... Actually, let me get my numbers. My current priority list is... Um, Alteration magic resistance, the smithing skills, and then upgrading my alchemy because I also make a bunch of potions. And after that speech, whichever I have the skills and ranks for. I always have a bunch of things going on at the same time. Oh right, we still have to go to the abandoned house, right? We had this quest. With the Boethia worshipper. Yeah, this guy. <laughs> if those white run guards can take down a dragon, so can we. Let's go. Blood and silver, friend. Multitask level one hundred. <laughs> yeah, it's it I always have a bunch of things going on. I mean if you wanna have a idea what's going on in my game this is m oh thank you for the follow um if you want to have a look at what's going on i always have like all the quests active that i'm actually planning to do eventually so that whenever i'm actually near a place where i can do a quest i will already be in a position to do it so actually we should probably go and check out this one maroon's razor this one, I don't know why it keeps on popping up again. I already finished it once. Yeah, we should probably do this one and this one. So that I can finally get the Galdas amulet out of my inventory and so that I can work on this. But I also want to finish rescuing him from the farm more. And this one, I've had this one in my inventory since forever. So yeah, um... I always keep all the quests that I actually intend to do marked. I should actually mark these as well. So that I will be able to find out when I'm near them. So this is my multitask level. Okay, abandoned house, let's go. I don't think it's gonna end well for you worshipping one Daedra at the altar of another Daedra. Like, I don't know who Moloch Baal is, but um, I don't think it's gonna end well for you, Boethia guy. Like, have you started or knew about the Ethereum war book? Uh, I don't think so, no. Ah, but I have my own champion this time, Logroff. What? You? Mortal, I give you my mace in all its rusted spitefulness. Crush the spirit from Logroff's bones. Make him bend to me. Okay, so, uh... Moloch Ball is no nicer than than Boethia, but you know, you kind of brought this on yourself, Lokrov. I'll never submit. I'll never submit. I'll never submit. I won't bend. Never. I'll never submit. Well, there we go. <laughs> Pathetic bodies. Try it again. What? K 
Can I just leave? What happens if I try to leave? Let me save. <laughs> Gives you four pieces of Ethereum equipment to pick from. The crown is the best. Uh, is this a DLC quest, by the way, or not? Because I'm playing vanilla without mods and without DLCs. Can I just leave? I can I can just leave if I want. But you know, we're already here. We've already started, let's get going. Yeah, if it's DLC, then unfortunately I won't be able to do it. Because this is this is the OG Skyrim version from like 2011. This is not even sold on Steam anymore. <laughs> uh, I, I just picked it up back in like, I think 2012, 2013, and then I... And then I just never played it until now. I'm sorry. Boethia. Yes. You're mine now, Logros. Kill him. This person is busy dying. Um. <laughs> I have to say, my character is usually a good two shoes, but my guy, you brought this upon yourself. The mace of Molag Bal. I give you its true power, mortal. When your enemies lie broken and bloody before you, know that I will be watching. Okay. Now, Thank you. I have a soul in oblivion that needs claiming. Take care of the house while I'm gone. I am never coming back to this place. No. Goodbye. I'll take those robes. They sell for a lot of money. Um, comparative to their weight, anyway. Um, how does that mace stack up compared to what we already have? 25 points of uh, stamina damage, 25 points of magicka damage. If target dies within three seconds, fills a soul gem. Yeah, we definitely don't want that. Because first of all, our ebony axe is does more damage, and secondly, I don't want to fill any more of my soul gems. I only have grand soul gems left, and I already accidentally filled a few of them with petty souls, so I don't want to do that anymore. Do I have any empty black soul gems? Yes, I do. 